it is behavior of a function in a certain interval so we need to know whether a function is strictly increasing or not in a certain interval let's say an interval i a function is said to be strictly increasing in an interval i increasing in an interval i if and only if for all x1 x2 belonging to i let's say there are any two elements in the interval i x1 and x2 for all x1 x2 belonging to i f of x1 greater than f of x2 should imply x1 is greater than x2 a function f of x is said to be strictly increasing in an interval i if and only if for all x1 x2 belonging to i f of x1 greater than f of x2 should imply x1 greater than x2 and also for any two numbers x1 and x2 belonging to i x1 greater than x2 should imply f of x1 greater than x2, f of x2 so this is a by implication so a function f of x is said to be a strictly increasing function in an interval i if and only if for all x1 x2 belonging to i f of x1 greater than f of x2 implies x1 greater than x2 for example let us look at the function f of x is equal to sin x and that too in an interval 0 to pi by 2 so our target is to discuss monotonicity of the function f of x is equal to sin x in the interval 0 to pi by 2 take any two abscissae x1 and x2 we can see x2 is to the right of x1 so x2 is greater than x1 now if this is to be a strictly increasing function then f of x2 has to be greater than f of x1 f of x2 is y coordinate of this point and f of x1 is y coordinate of this point and you can observe from the graph that y coordinate at x2 is much greater than y coordinate at x1 so f of x2 is greater than f of x1 likewise you take any combination of x1 and x2 x2 greater than x1 that is x2 to the right of x1 implies y coordinate at x2 will always be more than y coordinate at x1 or f of x2 will always be greater than f of x1 such functions they are called strictly increasing functions so whenever you are taking this definition to numericals whenever you are taking to this definition to numericals if you know that a function is strictly increasing if it is given that a function is strictly increasing or you know that a function is strictly increasing then over an inequality you can apply the function or remove the function if you know that a function is strictly increasing or if it is given that the function is strictly increasing then over an inequality you can happily apply the function or remove the function i will tell you in a simpler words let us say we know that f of x is an increasing function in interval i and it is also given that x1 and x2 two numbers which belong to i satisfy x1 greater than x2 it is given that x1 and x2 are two numbers belonging to the interval i and it is also given that x1 is greater than x2 now you can say f of x1 will be greater than f of x2 so once we know that f is a strictly increasing function we can apply f over an inequality for example log x to the base e is a strictly increasing function log x to the base e is strictly increasing function we know that 3 is greater than 2 so we can say log 3 to the base e will always be greater than log 2 to the base e we know that within 0 to pi by 4 between 0 to pi by 4 sin x will be smaller than cos x sin x values are smaller than the values of 
cos x and we also know that log is a strictly increasing function. So, I can apply log on both sides of the inequality and I can say log sin x to the base e is always less than log cos x to the base e.